techniques on removing the rotor. Remove the drive motor or you can inch it around. Rotate the rotor around. Before you enter the chain, lift the one end up over the chain and keep rotating until the rotor comes out. Right hand tensioner, left hand tensioner, starting point, center screw, equal distance in the slot. Secure it. Install your chain with a little tension. Once you got your chain installed with a little tension, take your rotor and engage it into the chain about a half an inch. Once you've engaged the rotor into the chain about a half an inch, view the other side with the sprocket on top of the chain. The pins of the chain should be adjusted slightly greater towards the inside. Once you have decided on your adjustment, complete engaging the rotor. Then install your drive motor. Once you've installed the drive motor, hook up a power supply and jog the rotor in. It must enter smoothly and exit smoothly. Apply a little pressure on the conductor ring. It also must enter in nice and smoothly on the, on the left side. Any additional adjustments on the right side will affect the alignment between the two. You need to realign the chain. And let's go back. When you're jogging the rotor in, you must have a little pressure applied to the conductor ring. 